Welcome back to Primal Gaming and Primal Completes Dark. Now, we're in a hell of a situation here. And that there's fucking people everywhere. Hard for us to actually get it. What about the alarm? It's all under control from what I heard. The police and fire department have left again. Mr. Steiner has some good contacts. Could be difficult to explain. Exactly. The dead cops are always difficult yeah, to get show us something. Yeah, show us something. You're not going upstairs. Yeah, show us something. Yeah, show us something. Oh, what? You just teleport in front of me. You don't stand a chance. Got him. I see him. Man down. Back there. Cover me. Where are you? You got him yet? Cover me, Nick. Advance it. I'll get him out of there. Cover me. So, so a few more in here. Show yourself. Go get the bastard. Got him. Moving out. Get him out of there. Cover me. Don't be an idiot. Show yourself! You got him yet? He must be furious! Shoot him! Cover me! You! Get him! Cover me! That was way too close, because it wasn't getting him. I'll get him out of there. Cover me! Where are you? I can't believe there's still more still in there? Coming. We know you're high. Got him! Halt! Cover! Kill him! <laughs> well, the guy's still I'll get him out of there. Cover me. You don't stand a chance. So fast as that goes. You got him yet? He must be back there. Cover me. You still in there? Go get the bastard! Here he is! I'll get him out of there. Shit, we lost a man! Yeah. No, you're hiding here somewhere. Show yourself! Need backup! You must be Target back person is here! <laughs> So it was a four left? Is that what we're saying? You don't stand a chance! We're just gonna do a save. I'm not really gonna. If I make it, I make it. I don't know. You 
You guys get him? I'll get him out of there. Here he is! Me. I'll get him. Don't be an idiot. Lead right, back, buddy. Target person is here. I see. Move to the Why can't I attack him? You must be back there. Cover. You don't stand a chance. You got him yet? We know you're hiding here somewhere. Got him! Come on, get him! I'll get him! Nice if I could get. Spread out. Nice if I could get some um, blood back. I am gonna take the save. You're hiding here somewhere. Got you must be back there. Cover me. I'll get him Okay, beating time at the zoo. Okay, right. So let's see. <laughs> Pub's clear now. I swear I saw a purple thing somewhere. Backstage soon. Do you think the master will still come to the show? I hope so, but the sun has already risen outside, so I don't think he's going to grace us with his presence. Oh, what a shame. I was hoping so much. Me too. Oh, me too. Okay. Rose, I found the controls for the door. Open sesame. Rose, are you still there? Yeah, sorry. I'm still here. But I can hardly keep awake. Okay, Rose, lie down and get some sleep. I can handle this alone. Of course. I've got to learn to stop saying things like that. 
What? You can handle it, you can handle it. How the hell did I get in here? I need to do a save, I know that much. So let's do that here. Seriously, how the hell did I get in here? <laughs> This is ladies are gone. I don't know if lady is the right term on this question. Seriously, how do I get out? This is actually quite a problem. in the game. I don't want to save if I can't get it out the back. This is quite bizarre, because the security's off too now. What do we expect that has to open? Oh god, there it is. Figured it out. I'm an idiot. Oh, I can't save. Scary. Oh, there's a minute cutscene. Oh, hello. Okay, this could Yes, this could be interesting. Terrifying. Be interesting. Oh my god. Oh my god, there's people here now too. Oh shit, son. Oh fuck's sake. So yeah, there's also not only is there uh Stop doing that! Why is it coming all the way out? There you go, That's a grenade. You must be back there. Need cover. Shit. Ah, what the shit? Okay, this could be interesting. I could see that. What? So they don't actually go anywhere, do they? Five cops. And whatever the hell that thing is. Oh my god, and lots of fucking slimy shits. Tools. Shit. Is it felt like going?
See your face, mister. Mm. Game. Okay, this could be interesting. Uh-oh. <laughs> okay, this could be interesting. If all I've got to do is get through this door, you know what I could do? Walk through the door. Something is seriously wrong in this city right now. Why? What's going on? Don't you listen to the news? Last night there were two terrorist attacks. First, the Harding Museum was destroyed, and the CO4 was about an hour ago. No idea what's going on, but I don't think there's anything to do with any religious fanatics. Something's fucking wrong with you, dammit. And neither one's really much of a loss either. Went to the exhibition at the museum a few days ago, and I was bored to death. The admission prices they charged at Geoport were so high you got altitude sickness. Still, it ain't that great having some madman running around the city blowing up this. Let's see what I can do with some of my powers. Uh, that. Those two, so I can get more blood for feeding. Having more blood. We could be next, damn it. <laughs> you will be you are next actually, not will be, you are. You are literally the next on my chain of things to destroy. Not weaklings like normal security contractors. If anyone shows up here, I'll shoot his ass off before he gets his hands up. Like that. Where you going, buddy? That didn't work very well. Let's take the reload. Something is seriously wrong in this city right now. Why? What's going on? Don't you listen to the news? Last night there were two terrorists. The Harding Museum was destroyed, and the Geo Force Tower followed about an hour ago. No idea what's going on, but I don't think this has anything to do with any religious fanatics. Something's fucking wrong with you, damn it. And 
and neither one's really much of a loss, are they? Went to the exhibition at the museum a few days ago, and I was bored to death. And the admission prices they charged at Geoforge were so high you got altitude sickness. Still, it ain't that great having some madman running around the city blowing up buildings. We could be next, damn it. <laughs> yeah, like that's gonna happen. The place is like a fortress, and we're trained mercenaries, not weaklings like normal security contractors. If anyone shows up here, I'll shoot his ass off before he gets his hands in. He's gonna spot the corpse. Man down, man down! Need back. I'll get him out of there. Yeah. Going? Oh my god, there's too many people there. No, I couldn't do it. I couldn't sag. Because I'm an idiot. Something is seriously wrong in this city right now. Why? What's going on? Don't you listen to the news? The hiding museum was destroyed, and the Geo Force Tower followed about an hour ago. No idea what's going on, but I don't think this has anything to do with any religious fanatics. Something's fucking wrong here, damn it. And neither one's really much of a loss, are they? Went to the exhibition at the museum a few days ago, and I was bored to death. And the admission prices they charged at Geo Forge were so high you got out. Alright, let's do this then. Altitude sickness. Still, it ain't that great having some madman running around the city blowing up buildings. We could be next, damn it. <laughs> yeah, like that's gonna happen. The place is like a fortress, and we're trained mercenaries, not weaklings like normal security contractors. If anyone shows up here, I'll shoot his ass off before he gets his hands up. So now that guard. And see it. Yes. Yeah. Hey, where did Fred go? My head started to hurt again. Hopefully I would be able to make it without collapsing. Hurry, Eric. You have to find Steiner. You have to find him, Eric. The angel's voice was more urgent than usual. I had the feeling time was running out. I had to hurry. He's inside. Go on, let the beasts out. Oh, scary, oh, oh my god, beasts, and... <sighs> Maybe I should have spent some money on that fucking remote kill spell. are not detectable by normal means. Attention! We have an intruder here require reinforcements! Does it not work for our... <laughs>
Oh, what? That what? He's inside. Go on, let the beasts out. Yes, we know. Well, save so I don't have to put up the stupid cutscene again. is gone. He's in a spot where he's out of the way too. So now it's only the um, ghouls. Ghouls are where the trouble's at. There was one right fucking there. Ooh, that's a big one. Starting to use powers. <laughs> they do turn around. Wasn't there four of the fox? The question is, is do I take them out? No, I won't bother. Not worth it. Too risky. Rose, are you still there? Rose, do you hear me? I'm in the security center. Okay, then I'll just do it alone. You said before <laughs> that you were going to. Uninvited guests. Oh, God.
I get them all. <laughs> I think I did. A few hours later, a still unknown number of explosives. The door clicked shut behind me, but that didn't matter. From the room ahead, I heard soft music. In the meantime, the sun had Whoa, risen. That looks bad. Bright and deadly light shone into the room through the skylight, but my focus was on the man who was sitting there playing the piano. That had to be Steiner. Uh oh. Big uh oh. Thank you. But I think I would rather speak to my guest alone. Well, you've come a long way for a half vampire. Frightening, the way you so easily got through my security system. I had help. Really? Interesting. We will need to talk about that later in a little more detail. But I am keenly interested as to why you were here at all. Tell me, what brings you to my humble home? Are you Victor Steiner? That is correct. I am Victor Steiner. This is my club. And those were my security personnel and my ghouls you killed. But I guess you already knew who you were dealing with. Anything else would be surprising. I would like to know more about vampires. Really? Well, it's quite commendable that you want to learn more about us and yourself. Please proceed. What would you like to know? Are there vampires older than you? Most certainly. If the world has taught me anything over the centuries, it is that nothing is impossible. But I think that it is sufficient for you to know that I am the oldest and most powerful vampire in this area. Tell me about your vampire abilities. <laughs> Good try. But I'm sure you'll find out soon enough. Tell me about Vampire Society. Vampire Society? Ah, oh, a very broad topic. To my regret, there is no real Vampire Society. Each of us, unfortunately, has a very healthy selfishness that keeps him from forming anything like a community with others. We are all born loners. There are simply a few rules we follow, such as keeping humanity ignorant of our existence. But otherwise, our society is pure anarchy. I suspect that you have come from Sanctuary. Who else would have sent you to me? That is a unique endeavor. Vampires who support one another. It's a pity I'm going to destroy them for sending you here. I have no further questions. Really? Well then... I need some of your blood. Ah, blood. Did your creator leave you behind alone? Yes. Well, I could offer you a place amongst my ghouls, but I doubt that the offer would interest you. So, if you want my blood, I'm certain you'll want to offer me something in return. Am I right? I have information. Information? That's interesting. Very interesting. What can we possibly Though have I have my him? doubts that a half-blood can tell me <laughs> anything right. relevant. But carry on. What can you offer me? I can tell you something about Blooming. About Blooming? Even if you hadn't killed him earlier tonight, there is nothing I would have cared to know about that misshapen creature anyway. In fact, I already know far too much about him. No, there's nothing I want to know about Blooming. You killed him, and he deserved to die. No one will miss him. Fair enough. I can tell you something about Vlad. About Vlad? Vlad is dead. What is there to care about? Moreover, you do not seem to realize that Vlad was working for me. I can tell you about the Sanctuary. Ah, yes. The Sanctuary. Do you really think that you can tell <laughs> me anything my spies have not already written hundreds of pages about? I know enough about it. Thank you. 
I'm afraid I don't have anything that would interest you. This is most regrettable. I would dearly love to know something about the people who blew up the museum. And the Geoforge Tower. I don't suppose you happen to know anything about them. No. I had assumed that one of you did that to cover up the existence of vampires. <laughs> that would have been a very clumsy way indeed to go about it, don't you think? Well, I shall have to look into hey, that I didn't again up, later. Else blew them up. I'll let you live. <laughs> Most generous. Yet I fear that you have either somewhat overestimated your own powers, or underestimated mine. I assume that you had something to do with the events at the museum. And at Geoforge. Am I right? I must admit, that did impress me. Oh, Blooming was a weakling. But Vlad, Vlad had potential. Strange that a half-blood could destroy him. Nevertheless, you underestimate me at this point. I fear you will find me a much more formidable enemy. Enough talk. Ah, do I sense a latent death wish? Good. Then let us begin. Oh, son of a bitch. I can't if he's gonna fight him. When the fight started, I knew it was already lost. The sunlight should have been my ally, but Steiner seemed to be immune to it. On the other hand, it burned into my flesh like fire. My second death seemed inevitable. Light blinded me as soldiers stormed the hall. I had seen this equipment before. The burglars in the museum had been similarly equipped. The sun didn't bother Steiner one bit. The enemy's bullets were another story. Steiner hit the ground. The gunfire subsided, leaving an eerie silence. A luminous apparition entered the scene. I thought the angel had come to save me. I was wrong. It seemed the woman gave the soldiers their orders. Uh -oh. Apparently they were only interested in Steiner. Good thing for me. I took the opportunity to make my escape. The passage through which the guards had come seemed to be my only chance. I ran and used my powers as best I could. My life depended on it. My pursuers' voices grew quieter and finally disappeared. Down here, it would take them forever to find me, hopefully. The rising sun forced me to sleep. As the sun went down once more, I awoke. I couldn't understand what had happened in Atlantis. Was there such a thing as vampire hunters? Rose was my only clue, again. I made my way to the sanctuary. The sanctuary was in a seedy part of town destroyed by fire 15 years ago. Since then, it has been home to those who had no place else to go. They dubbed it the hole. Rose, can you hear me, Rose? No answer. Cool. We'll leave it there. Uh, it's been a long episode due to the uh, story. But thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. And as always, we'll see you next time. Bye for now.